What's going on, everybody? This is Chris G. And um, I wanted to talk about the show I had seen on YouTube. It's, it's picking up um, a lot of popularity. And it's called uh, Pop the Balloon or Find Love. And um, it has a, a lot of African Americans on it. You know, it has, um, you know, a, a, a basically a line of women that are standing there uh, with balloons. And the gentleman comes out from behind the wall. And, uh, you know, the ladies end up, you know, choosing uh, what, you know, if, if, whether or not they want the man or not. And if they if they don't want him, they basically end up popping a balloon. Well, I got to tell you, this show is like, <laughs> I'm telling you, this show is seriously saw mouse, man. They have a lot of uh, wild stuff on there. I, I, I seen an episode where um, they had a gentleman come out, you know, and I mean, this, this guy was, you know, um, he, he, he was looking pretty sharp, you know, and, uh, you know, nicely dressed and stuff like that. But, um, you know, uh, one of the ladies, uh, you know, basically was like, uh, you know, they didn't want him for some type of like, some type of really, you know, a, a, a basically a reason that it really could be fixed, man. You know, um, you know, something like, I think it was like the clothes he had on or something like that. And I'm just like, lady, if the guy's got his him, himself, you know, set up together, he's got things going going on, you know. He's working, you know, where he, uh, and I think that guy in particular, I think he had his own business or something like that, you know, uh, you know, so it's just like small little things that can be corrected. A lot of ladies basically were just like rejecting the dude, you know, different dudes, man. And uh, I just think that that stuff is crazy. And, and another time I saw another gentleman come out, you know, uh, this guy was like, he was like six feet tall. He was playing uh, pro basketball. I'm not sure what league. I don't think it was the NBA, but it might have been maybe like a, maybe like a B league or something like that, D league, something like that, or um, you know, just some type of league. He was playing, playing ball, and it was a young guy, young, vibrant, you know, uh, looked like a very healthy young man, and even he got rejected. And, you know, a lot of women today said they want a guy that's like six feet tall. So I'm just like, you know, why are you rejecting this guy? I mean, the guy is obviously six feet. You know, a lot of these ladies want these really tall guys, man. You know, so like they're just rejecting a lot of really good dudes that have good things going on, you know, um, and ladies just, you know, not one guy because, you know, his, uh, <clears throat> excuse me, he, he was um, his clothes, you know, something like I think a particular color clothes that can be changed. You know, you, uh, there are good guys will come out. And, and another thing I thought that was um, really strange is, you know, it's like if like. One lady pops a balloon and doesn't like the guy, then you'll have like a whole bunch of other ladies popping a balloon too, you know. And I just thought that was really bizarre. I'm like, ladies, you know, the, you know, one lady didn't want him, he might be good for another lady, you know what I'm saying? Like, you, you might be missing out on something special, but I'm, I'm, you know, my my take on it, I think it was, it's like a lot of like, you know, hive mind mentality type of stuff where it's like, oh, she popped a balloon, oh, I'm gonna pop it too, you know. And, and it might even be a a, a possible. Uh, a mindset of like, you know, well, I don't want no dude that just, you know, got rejected by another lady, you know, it, it could be a combination of stuff, but it just, I just find it to be really just bizarre how, you know, you got good dudes coming through there, man, and they're just steadily getting shot down, and um, I, I may have seen, I'm trying to remember, I've seen so many folks getting rejected and stuff, so many guys, man, there may have been maybe one episode I've probably seen where the guy, um, actually uh, found a match you know I, I would have to watch a whole lot more of these videos i've just seen like just a handful of them you know just kind of like snippet stuff here and there but um i gotta tell you you gotta have i i would say like a certain level of like guts to go on there man because you could like seriously get humiliated on there you know sometimes i've seen you know people saying you know why did, did you reject me and you know they would people <laughs> some of the ladies would be you know having something like they would have like a little attitude toward the dude you know, why they, you know, rejected him or something like that. Sometimes the dude would have, like, he'll fire back and have, like, kind of like an attitude towards the lady. So it's a real, real wild show. And, man, you know, and I, I, I've seen sometimes, man, I, and I hate to say it, you know, you know, shout out to, to everybody, you know, all the gentlemen out there trying to find ladies. But I will say, you know, um, if you're if you're vertically challenged, you know, and I'm not trying to throw shade or, or be rude, but if you're vertically challenged, man, let's just say, you know, if you're if you're under six feet tall, you know, it's a it's a pretty good chance you're going to end up getting that balloon popped real early. You know, you could be a guy that got has his own business going, 
you know what I'm saying? Just, uh, you know, just just doing real well in life. You know, sharp dresser, got the nice slacks with the dress shoes on, you know, nice button up, all that stuff. You know, uh, probably going to get do some entrepreneur type of stuff, uh, you know, business thing going on. But it's like if you're five foot seven, you're getting shot down. You know, I, I hate to say it, man, but like it, it's, it's like that on that show, man. It's brutal. So, you know, if you're under six feet, I, I wouldn't even suggest going on there. Just, you know, just, you know, to keep you to save you from the embarrassment, man. I mean, I want I want everybody to win tall, short, you know, all type of, you know, heights and stuff like that. But, um, you know, it's just like it, it's, it's going to be real. Oh, man, it's, it's going to be real tough for you because I'm telling you, a lot of these ladies, it's like if you're under six feet, a lot of times they're shooting you down, man. A bunch of times. And the crazy part about it is, man, you like there'll be a, a lady, you know, she'll shoot down a guy to do might be like he might be like five, like five ten. You're only like you're only like two inches away from like being six feet, man. It, like seriously. And, and she'll be like, she'll be like pop the pop balloons, like, oh well, you're too short. And this lady will be like five foot four. I was like, Are you serious? I'm like, lady, the dude's still taller than you. You know what I'm saying? Like, you really should give that guy a chance, man. But um, it's crazy, man. I tell you, it's something else. Me, I, I, I want to go on that show. I already know I ain't six feet. They'll be pop, pop, pop. They'll be popping that balloon all crazy. So I'd be like, shoot, I ain't even, ain't no point in me going on there, you know. But um, it's, it's definitely um, uh, something that would, you know, pique a person's attention if they watch it, you know. But, but um, you know, it's, it's, it's a pretty wild show. And um, I think also, too, they got an episode... Uh, or, or or type of a uh, series where they have it the other way around where um you have the um i think it's where uh instead of the dudes lining up how is it i think it's it's like uh yeah well i think it's instead well yeah they have like the it's the other way around i'm i'm sorry i'm kind of confused but like i said instead of the dude coming out it'd be the woman coming out you know, and, um, you know, uh, trying to figure out, you know, which, you know, guy that, you know, she wants and stuff like that. Um, I'm going to try to see more of those episodes, but yeah, it's, it's, it's a crazy show, you know, but like I said, you would have to definitely have some type of strong bearing, you know, gust to go on there. Cause I mean, you could get popped real quick, man. But another thing too, is just like, you got a lot of ladies that, you know, they, they want, a good man, it's like he's right there, but it just like minor things you're just projecting him for. And uh, I wonder if some of those days, you know, if they end up feeling like a, a feeling of regret if they end up rejecting some of them dudes. You know what I'm saying? And and one thing I would say as advice uh, for for some of those dudes, if you go in there and get shot down, because I've seen some guys get shot down, I'm just like, damn, man, I feel bad for that dude. But it's like, you know, guys are going there. It, I would just say, man, like keep your head up, man. You know, and just go ahead and just, you know, keep on pushing and striving in life, you know, and um, just, just do what you can, you know, because like a lot of those ladies, they reject you. That's probably a blessing because some of those ladies probably will give you problems, man. You know, I, I, I seen, I mean, I seen one lady on there. She was talking about something along of like, she said some, basically she was basically with the type of rhetoric she was saying, she was basically saying she was like, a, 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 I guess like a, a, a violent person. Or uh, like a, like a conflict person or something like that, and I'm like, you know, do, do, you know, it's like, would you really want something like that? A woman that's like combative, wanting to put her hands on you, stuff like that. It's like y'all supposed to be loving and caring for each other and stuff like that, not, you know, uh, throwing hands and 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 being combative and having domestic problems and stuff like that. You know, so um, I, I just thought that was strange. So you know, any guy that got rejected by her, you you should, it really should be thankful for that. But um, this Chris G, like I said, I just wanted to give my comments, review on that show. And, uh, you know, that pop the balloon and find love. So uh, this is Chris G signing off. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Peace.